A man was caught on camera breaking into a self storage facility on Hickson Pike. Chattanooga police say they are interviewing the man they believe is seen in that video. No arrest has been made, but Tanisha Cordell explains why police say solving this case will help solve others. Cindy, that's right. Lieutenant Kevin Atkins told me the public storage facility on Hickson Pike has an electric gate entrance. He says the fact that this man was able to break in so easily means he has done this before and may be responsible for other recent burglaries. Three storage units all burglarized on the same day. Unfortunately, we've got a lot of thieves running around in Chattanooga right now. It happened last Wednesday around 6 a.m. at this self storage facility on Hickson Pike. Lieutenant Kevin Atkins says moments before surveillance cameras caught someone driving into the facility. It shows what appears to be a white man get out of a white Dodge Ram truck. He goes back and forth from the truck to the gate with something in his hand. From the damage that we found and the way he entered, we're probably some type of tool that he's using to jimmy the gate or uh, make entry uh, to circumvent the electronic system there. He seems to have known what he was doing. After a few attempts, it worked and the suspect drove through the gate. Lieutenant Atkins believes that man is responsible for stealing from individual units. But he knew that there's stuff in there. He might have known somebody that told him, hey, I've got a storage unit over there. I've kept all my stuff in there. He, then specifically, he might have seen or known where, what units to go to. He wouldn't list what was stolen, but says the items totaled at least $1,000. It's a felony amount. A felony would be over a thousand, a thousand dollars. You'll have a burglary charge. Uh, you possibly would have some vandalism uh, charge for the damage to the gate. You know, the damage to the locks on each individual unit. A burglary charge for each individual unit. So there's there's a lot of charges that come from this. Well, Lieutenant Atkins says this is the first storage burglary they have caught on camera this month, but there have been more. Again, police say they believe they have the man responsible, but again, the arrest has not been made. So if you have any information, go ahead and call police. For now, live in the studio, Tanisha Cordell, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.